Hello friends, welcome to Bootstrap 5 video tutorials series. In the previous video tutorials, we understood what is Bootstrap, how to download Bootstrap, how to add Bootstrap to our website, Bootstrap text formatting related classes, Bootstrap text size related classes. In this video tutorial, I would like to discuss Bootstrap text color related classes. We understand how to set color to text in Bootstrap 5 guys. Here you can see that at the desktop I have my dash website folder. I open it. Inside my dash website folder we have default.html page. I right click on it. Say open with the notepad. You can see that default.html page is open in the notepad. Its title is set to Bootstrap demo. You can see that. I minimize it. I right click on default.html page. Say open with the Google Chrome. You can see that default.html page is open in the Chrome and title is set to Bootstrap Demo. Let's understand Bootstrap text color related classes. First we have text dash primary class. It displays the text in blue color guys. If I go here in the body section, I am going to add a paragraph. I say here paragraph text closing p tag. I am going to copy that and paste on. If I say file, save, go to browser and refresh, you see paragraph text, paragraph text displayed in the black color. If I go to the second paragraph and use the class text dash primary, if I say file, save, go to browser and refresh, you can see that this paragraph text is displayed in the blue color, right? Next we have text dash secondary class. It displays the text in mid gray color guys. If I go here, take a paragraph, copy and paste, file, save, go to browser and refresh. Paragraph text is displayed in the black color. Let's change it to mid gray color. So simply, I am going to say here class of text dash secondary. If I say file, save, go to browser and refresh. You see it is displayed in the mid gray color. Next we have text dash success class. It displays the text in green color guys. If I go here, take the paragraph, paste down, file, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see paragraph text is displayed in the black color. If I have to display it in the green color, simply I am going to take help of the class text dash success. If I say file, save, go to browser and refresh, you can see this, this paragraph text is getting displayed in the green color. Next we have text dash warning class. It displays the text in yellow color guys. For example, I am going to copy this paragraph and paste down, file, save, go to browser and refresh. Paragraph text is displayed in the black color. Let's display in the yellow color. So I use the class text dash warning. If I say file, save, go to browser and refresh, you see it is displayed in the yellow color. Next we have text dash info class. It displays the text in cyan color. For example, I take a paragraph, paste down, file, save, go to browser and refresh, you see paragraph text is displayed in the black color. I want to display it in the cyan color. So simply I take help of the class text dash info. If I say file, save, go to browser and refresh, you can see this paragraph text is displayed in the cyan color. Next we have text dash danger class. It displays the text in red color guys. For example, if I take this paragraph and paste down, file, save, go to browser and refresh, you can see paragraph text is displayed in the black color. I want to display this in the red color. So simply I am going to use the class of text dash danger. If I say file, save, go to browser and refresh, you can see this paragraph text is displayed in the red color. Next we have text dash dark. It displays the text in dark gray color. For example, if I take this paragraph 
and paste down file save go to browser and refresh it displays the paragraph text here in black color if i go here and use the class of text dash dark file save go to browser and refresh so the paragraph text is displayed little bit darker compared to the previous uh, color guys you can see next we have text dash light class it displays the text in light gray color for example if i take this paragraph and paste down file save go to browser and refresh i want to display this little bit light in color so simply i say class of text dash light if i say file save go to browser and refresh you see this paragraph text is displayed light in color light gray in color you can see that right we have the text here you can see paragraph text is there next we have text dash white which displays the text in white color guys so for example if i take the paragraph and paste here file save go to browser and refresh you see paragraph text is displayed i want to make it white so simply i use the class called as text dash white if i say file save go to browser and refresh you can see the paragraph text is displayed in the white color white light dark right next we have text dash muted it also displays the text in mid gray color so if i copy this code and paste down and replace this with text with muted if i say file save go to browser and refresh you can see we got the paragraph text which is displayed little bit in a mid gray color somewhat like this guys like secondary so you can change the text color with the help of bootstrap text color related classes if you want to set your own color then you can take help of the css color property guys so we know that in css to change the text color we take help of the color property or color style right so for example if i have a paragraph i am going to copy that and paste down if i say file save go to browser and refresh you see the paragraph text is displayed i want to display it in the red color so simply i can use the css style of color colon red i can mention the color name so if i say file save go to browser and refresh this paragraph text is displayed in the red color you can also use the hexadecimal color code value so instead of saying here red i can say hash ff0000 that also makes this paragraph display in red color if i say file save go to browser and refresh you see this paragraph text is also getting displayed in the red color you can also use the rgb function red green blue where red green blue value take the value between 0 and 255 so for example if i copy this and paste down and here instead of using the hexadecimal value i say r g b function i am calling you over here and here we have to give three values so we want to display this paragraph text in the red color so i am going to say here 255 that indicates that we have complete red color no green no blue so this paragraph text if i save go to browser and refresh it is also displayed in the red color let's see i have not used rgb function red green blue green and blue we have set 00 red 255 file save go to browser and refresh you can see the paragraph text is displayed in the red color you can also use the rgba function right red green blue and alpha where alpha value can be 0 to 1 so 1 means uh, opacity full so if i say file save go to browser and refresh next paragraph also displayed in the red color you can see that so you can use the predefined classes or you can use the css 
property color to change the text color at any time guys i hope you guys have clearly understood i suggest you people to try the code yourself and try to remember all the class names if you have any doubts do not hesitate to put the doubts in the comment section and if you like this video hit the like button and share with your friends so that everyone will get benefited in the upcoming video tutorials we will discuss more about bootstrap 5 for more benefits and be updated do not forget to subscribe to our youtube channel keep learning keep coding keep sharing thank you guys thank you very much see you in the next tutorial